everybody. Um, so today I'm going to be doing a video on holiday gift ideas. Yay! So I was going to try and get this up before today, which is Black Friday, because I know everyone goes shopping on Black Friday and there's all those deals and all that stuff, but that never happened. So I'm going to put this up hopefully today or tomorrow and hopefully there will still be some sales going on throughout the rest of the week and Cyber Monday. And if you guys know what Cyber Monday is, it's when all the online stores have sales. So hopefully it's going to be okay. And the holidays are coming up and usually there are some like good deals and stuff. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started. So first I'm going to mention is Bath and Body Works Body Cream. And this is in black amethyst. This is the old packaging. We have it in new packaging, but it still smells the same. I went and smelt it, and I love this stuff. This is extremely moisturizing. I really, really do like this stuff. Um, I have extremely dry skin, and usually like the medicated stuff, but this stuff actually works amazingly. Im I can't talk to you guys. Amazingly well. So I recommend that. I know you're like, oh, best thing body works again, but it is a good place to buy gifts. I have to say it. I mean, it's a little, like, overdone, but it's still a good place. They are having a sale today, I know. It's buy three, get three free. Hopefully, it's still on tomorrow and Sunday, but if not, no, it's not super overpriced or anything. This one was $12, and I've had that for a while. Okay, so next, oh yeah, I'm going to try and mention everything from lower-end budgets to higher-end budgets, so we'll see. Another thing, and some of these aren't even beauty-related, so... This is OPI, and this is Do You Lie Like It, but nail polishes are the second thing I'm going to mention. Um, you can, these are really fun. You can get them in like, you know, three or four, a set of three or four, or you can buy them individually and stick them in stockings, which I think is great. This is my favorite color right now. It's been my favorite color for a while. It's Do You Lie Like It, and I'm not wearing this right now, which is kind of weird. But, yeah. Okay, next thing. I'm trying to make this fast so you guys aren't sitting here for 10 minutes. Moisturizers. I'm thinking about getting my mom um, Philosophy's Hope in a Jar. It's a little pricey at like $40 and up for like the bigger jars. But I think for like my mom and stuff, I think it's worth it. So if you guys have that budget, you know, you can always think about that. I think moisturizers are super important. So, you know. And if you guys have bigger budgets even, there's always La Mer. If you guys don't know what that is, YouTube it has great reviews. Um, okay, next thing. Brace uh, bracelets. I um, enjoy making bracelets like these and um, I just make them for fun. Wow, okay. You can get like all sorts of different beads. You can get these like sparkly Swarovski ones and like just regular beads at your local craft store and I got these at um, Joann's. But they're really easy to make, really easy to learn how to make and they're more, I guess, personal because you spent your time and you made them instead of buying them. So, bracelets are really good stuff. Next, perfume. Um, this is Viva La Juicy. This is a small one. Um, I got this. Um, I don't remember I got this, but it's really nice perfume. But really, any perfume would do. The only problem with perfume is you have to know the person really well and what they like really well because scents are extremely, extremely personal. So, um, I think perfumes are really good gifts to give, especially those, like, in the gift sets with the, like, body lotions and stuff. I think those are really good, um, gifts. Another thing that you guys don't know about, Sephora has these Sephora Favorites perfume. Um, they call it Favorite Collector's Edition Fragrance, Fragrance Sampler. And this particular one comes in set, a set of nine, and you can just get this, and then you try them all, and they, I think it comes with a gift card, and you can trade it in for a full bottle of whichever one you liked best. These are slightly pricey, but I think they're a good deal. So you guys want to think about that. Okay, sorry, I'm just like out of breath for some reason. Okay, another thing. Um, makeup sets, I don't have a picture of any right now, but I know Urban Decay has one of their, um, 24-7 liners. I think that's a really good idea because, like me, I love eyeliners, so having a whole set of them would make everything a lot easier. <laughs> um, I think, oh, one more. 
candles. This is from Yankee Candle, and this is in Sun and Sand. Oh my gosh, this one smells really good. And I have hardly even used this because I'm like OCD about fire. But candles make really good gifts too. But like I said, scents are extremely personal. So um, be careful when you're buying scents for people. I do have one thing to mention. Um, gift cards. I know everyone's like gift cards. But um, they are really quick. They're easy. They're fast. And there's, whomever you're giving it to is still going to appreciate it. So I think for the most part it's the thought that counts. So if you think about it. Does it really matter? I mean, if you really are at no, at a loss, you know, like, what am I going to buy this person? Just a Visa gift card or Starbucks gift card or just, you know, anything. Just a gift card. I think it's a really good idea. Especially when you're, like, in a twist. Like, oh, no. You know, like, say, you know, the day before Christmas or the day before Christmas Eve, you're like, you're like crap, I forgot to buy my friend a, a gift, you know. Just run out. Go get a gift card. I think they're really easy, really simple. You know? Okay. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I think I covered everything. If I didn't, I'll put, like, little pop-ups or, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. And, yeah, that's it. Okay, bye.